क्वेश्चन नंबर वन है हमारे पास f इज द फंक्शन ऑफ x वेयर 5x minus 10 आपको पहला फंक्शन पुट करना है यानी f की वैल्यू 0 पुट करनी है x की वैल्यू 0 पुट करनी है देन x की वैल्यू minus 2 और देन x की वैल्यू a plus b तो लेट्स फिगर इट आउट फर्स्ट हम जो है x equals to 0 पुट करते हैं दैट मींस 5x minus 10 5x की वैल्यू 0 पुट कर दी minus 10 5 0 is 0 minus 10 तो योर आंसर इज minus 10 now x equals to minus 2 5x minus 10 5 minus 2 minus 10 then 5 2s are 10 minus 10 minus 10 minus 20 in this line and let's move out to our third value which is x equals to a plus b we have 5x minus 10 here I am going to put x a plus b. So instead of x, I am putting a plus b. Why? Because here they are asked to put a plus b as a function of x. So I am writing a plus b as a function of x, then minus 10. Now I am going to multiply 5 with a, that will be 5a plus 5b minus 10. This is first question solved. This is your answer. So your answer is minus 10, minus 20 and 5a plus 5b minus 10. Now let's solve another question which is question number 2. Now 2 is same so you are going to solve by yourself. I am solving question number 3 that is minus x plus 4. So let's put x equals to 0 so here minus 0 plus 4 minus 0 0 is always 0 so you don't write any sign with 0 and neither write 0 so the answer is 4 now let's put x equals to minus 2 so in minus x plus 4 I am writing minus minus 2 plus 4 here minus minus would be plus that will be plus 4 minus multiply with minus that will be plus so plus 4 plus 4 that will be equals to this is 2 that will be 6 so minus minus plus and 2 6 now for the third one here minus x plus 4 so I am going to put minus a plus b plus 4 minus a minus b why because minus multiply with plus there will be minus minus multiply with plus there will be minus and then plus 4 this is your answer in question number 4 minus x divided by 2 so let's put 0 upon 2 there will be 0 and then minus 2 divided by 2 that will be minus minus plus 2 upon 2 that will be 1 and now minus a plus b divided by 2 that will be minus a minus b divided by 2 the question solved now let's solve question number 5 so here in question number 5 f is a function of m x plus b here first i will write x equals to 0 so I am going to put 0 instead of x. So m multiply with 0 that will be 0 plus b. So the answer is plus b. Now for the second one where I need to put x equals to minus 2. That will be m plus x plus b. Now m equals to minus 2 that will be b. So minus 2m plus b this is your answer. For the third one, 
where m x plus b now m a plus b plus b now i want you to concentrate that will be m a plus m b plus b and this is your answer now i think that you can do different questions so uh I'm moving towards question number 11. Here T. For T, you're going to put 0. Why we put the value of 0 minus 2 and a plus b into 2? Because here the function is f equals to t. So we have to concentrate on the function. So now I'm going to solve question number 9 where f t equals to t square plus t minus 5 that means that 0 square plus 0 minus 5 so that will be minus 5 this is the answer and I am going to put minus 2 so that f t equals to t square plus t minus 5 you can write f equals to 0 so now I am going to put minus 2 is a function that is minus 2 square plus minus 2 minus 5 2 multiply with 2 because the square of 2 is 4 and the power becomes and the sign becomes plus that is plus minus minus 2 minus 5 minus 2 minus 5 that will be minus 7 and 4 that will be minus 3 so I have the function 2 will be minus 3. Now for the third part where a plus b t square plus t minus 5. So a plus b square plus a plus b minus 5. Remember the formula. What is the formula? The formula of a plus b whole square is a square plus b square plus 2ab and a minus b whole square equals to a square b square minus 2ab. So I am going to solve with the formula that will be a square plus b square plus 2ab plus a plus b minus 5. This is your answer. So that's it. Now what you need is to just put the value 0 here, then minus 2 instead of u, then a plus b instead of u. And same thing applying in each and every question. So you don't need to worry, just solve the question and you will get the answer. For a cube formula, a cube plus 3 square b plus 3 a b square plus b cube this is the formula of a plus b's whole cube you will require to solve with the formula when you put the value of f is a function of a cube let me solve this for you here a cube minus 10 is the question in question number 11 In question number 11, there is a question f u, that means f is a function of u where u minus 3 equals to 10. I am directly putting this value because rest of the function is easy to understand and easy to solve. Here, instead of u, I am going to write a plus b cube minus 10. So now I have to put the formula of a cube plus b cube for a plus b whole cube. So I am going to write a cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square plus b cube minus 10. This will be your answer.
same thing you will have to do with uh, other question and i hope that i'm looking forward to entertain your queries so uh, don't hesitate and uh, complete the questions thank you